just entered Washington State. Yay! Yay! We're super excited. We uh, ran into a little bit of uh, um, snow, snow and, but it was fine. We prayed about it. We put uh, prayer requests on Facebook and y'all prayed for us. And um, what was it, like five, ten minutes later, cleared up. So God answers prayers just like that, so fast. Um, but we're headed over now to Spokane, Washington. Spokane, Washington. To uh, <coughs> we're gonna <coughs> re dinner there. Have dinner, and uh, we might stop for tonight, or we're just gonna keep pressing on. Yeah, I'll probably stop. We might press on. We'll see. So, anyways, the girls are. Having fun back there. Emily's playing her knobby. What's Natalie doing? Watching. <laughs> Watching Emily play her knobby. What are you playing? I was playing Brand the Rope. Oh, Brand the Rope. <laughs> we were listening to Captain's Club. Captain's Club. Yeah, but we listened to all five of those. Go ahead, turn those off. Oh. Turn that light on, Natalie. Mark needs the lights off. Okay. So, they were watching, cat, listening to Captain's Club, but we listened to all of those. And then, we're just having fun back there. Say hello. Hello. She's busy. <laughs> Do something funny. <laughs> all right, y'all are weird. Anyway, right. we're on our, um, it's this basically the second to last leg of our trip, uh, up until we get on the ferry, um, from, you know, driving into Seattle, and then we gotta drive up to the port for, uh, uh, to get on the ferry, which is the last leg of our, this trip, and then the ferry is a break, and then we got another two days up in Alaska. We might, we might drive through, um, we might drive through, uh, Alaska, uh, through Canada, uh, the 23rd, which is Monday, uh, and try to get into Alaska by Christmas, uh, Fairbanks by Christmas, but, because, uh, we called the housing office up there in Alaska, and they have a house that may be ready for us, so. Hooray! That's an answer prayer, <laughs> that too. That is a big answer prayer. You're like, you're like I'm enjoying you. And uh, anyway, so... Diva. <laughs> we've been praying for uh, a house already be ready for us and available so that we don't have to continue to be in a, a hotel. So... Um, they're going to call us fri this Friday. Right. This Friday, they're going to contact us and, you know, tell us what, what's available or if there's only one house, they're going to get... Um, Give us the floor plan and all that information. Oh, give us the floor plan and uh, so that we can see it and see what it looks like before we decide. I guess we can decide on it. I don't know. But, hey, if it's available, we want it. We're good. So. Um, it'll at least give us some time to, <laughs> it'll at least give us some time to settle in and then find out um, if we can get a different one, if it's not a good one or whatever. But. I'm sure it'll be a good one because uh, the Lord's in it, right? Amen. So. We were, I was looking at the <coughs> floor plans and the communities online. Sorry. Um, and um, they all look nice. I like the floor plans in a lot of them. <coughs> There's some of them that have an Arctic entryway and then with heated garages. Some of them, <coughs> sorry, some of them have basements and a lot of open floor plans, so they're really, really nice, so we're hoping we get a really nice one. Mark doesn't like the quadruplex, he wants just like a duplex type thing, so we'll see how that happens, but um, anyways, the scenery is beautiful through the mountains. <coughs> I slept a little bit of the way, but... All in all, I've been up feeling okay. Got cough still. Um, so, yeah, if 
uh, if they do have the house available, then uh, <coughs> we may, like I said, we may uh, try to get up there before. Well, you know, we might even have to drive on Christmas Day, but it'll be a good Christmas present to be done with the trip <laughs> and to have a house to stay in, right? Yeah. But anyway, um, so if they have a house for us, we might try to drive. Well, it'll be Monday the 23rd and maybe Christmas Eve. We'll be up there before Christmas. We wouldn't, be, we wouldn't have to drive. <coughs> if we could get up there before Christmas, but stuff is going to be closed. Like the housing office is going to be closed. How's that going to work? They may be closed on Christmas Day, but they won't. They shouldn't be closed on. Uh... So we're going to have to get a. What we'll the? I out. think they'll work up there. I, Cause it's too cold on the window, so it doesn't suction cup to it. So I have to hold it, and I can't convers hold us both having a conversation. Anyways, <laughs> it does. Really it does when you put it up next to the window. That sees us both. It does. Let me see. Yeah. I don't know. You gotta see it in the window. <laughs> I can see it in the window a little bit. Anyway, so uh, just keep, continue to pray for us, and uh, we thank you for your prayers. Um, this trip has been awesome. It has been a blessing. The Lord has been in this trip since the beginning, I think. And the roads have, <coughs> except for that little bit of part, well, the part in Nashville that was very foggy, and then the part here that was very snowy, it's been clear. That no was, construction. Actually, that wasn't that bad because we were actually going down, downhill, and uh, <coughs> in, that, in the snow part, we were going downhill, so... And on the Dodge, it, and some others do too, it won't let you just coast. It'll it'll hold you back. Yeah. So the truck w went very well in it. And um, at one point, I did put it in four high just so uh, I could get around these, this uh, this line of slow traffic. I mean, there, this one this one vehicle was just holding like 20 vehicles up, and I just figured I was pass them, so I passed them. Yeah, because everybody was in one lane. They just all, were all in one lane because nobody wanted to pass. Nobody was, I think people are just scared to pass on that yeah. second lane. And Mark's like, I'm passing. <laughs> so we passed, but the uh, Lord protected us. He did but, a good uh, job. He did it in a very safe way where he wasn't just speeding through it. He was just, you know. Just let the, uh, just let the truck do whatever it wanted. <laughs> right. It has, it has a mind of its own. Yeah. <laughs> but anyway. On a side note, I was thinking uh, when we were at Mount Rushmore, I was thinking about how you know we we worship uh, man and we worship uh, objects, and then uh, we see Mount Rushmore and then we passed uh, Crazy Horse, oh, which man. they're building uh, a statue, you know, to uh, Crazy Horse to honor Crazy Horse. That thing, and it's bigger. It's huge. It's, it's bigger, bigger than, than, Mount, than Rushmore. Mount Rushmore. So, but then I got to thinking about the Sphinx and. And all the stuff that's in Egypt and how they built stuff to worship and to, you know, to worship the God King, Pharaoh or whatever. And that's just what we're doing now. I mean, we're worshiping, uh, you know, they're worshiping Mount Rushmore. And it's kind of, uh, like I was saying before, it's just uh, worshiping this I I object, uh, this object or this item. And, uh, and then when we drove through... Um, we were driving through Montana and we were driving through the mountains there and it just again, like it was in bad, the Badlands, how God, you know, has, his handiwork is so much better than man. And uh, it was just beautiful. And oh man, it's like 10 times, like a million times better than man's handiwork. If we, if we come Gorgeous. down, come down to the lower 48 to visit again, we'll probably drive through again just so we can see it. Because it's it's just so beautiful. If y'all do go to Mount, uh, Mount Rushmore, my dad said he was gonna do that. Go through the Badlands and then stop at the Circle View Guest yes. Ranch. They are a really good uh, facility there. It's owned by this husband and wife. How many acres was it? Twenty. They had uh, twenty eight hundred acres. Twenty eight hundred acres, man. Just waking up. To that gorgeous view, oh man, it was, it was nice. I liked it. And they had, they made a really, really good, delicious breakfast. And I mean, 
they you, you sit with the family and you, it's like you're sitting with friends and the the rooms are like bedrooms of course they are bedrooms but you feel like you're at somebody's house visiting a friend and it was really nice to have a little kitchen out you can use and fridge and laundry facilities have a game room anyways if you do go through there we recommend the Badlands Loop and then if you if you uh, take you go through the Badlands Loop but you come off of 44 I think or yeah, what you, well you gotta go you gotta go to interior, interior. Badlands interior and uh, there are a little bed and, there are bed and breakfast down there and uh, stop at the convenience store and they will tell you where to go yeah. and it you will not be disappointed the rates are pretty good um, they're not bad um, for two bed two bed what did we do well we, we got an off season right? yeah it was off season right but I mean it was like 70 something dollars so it was good for two bedrooms and you got your bathroom and stuff so two beds, two beds. Not two bedrooms. I'm sorry. Anyway, so... Uh, but it was good. We're going to be stopping here pretty soon. We haven't eaten dinner yet. and uh, Girls are hungry. Emily's hungry. That soon. Actually, it's, we just went back an hour, too. So, yeah. right now we're at uh, 6.20. Oh, yeah. We got to change that again. We got to change that again. And so. it's 33 degrees outside. So, it's gotten, it's gotten warmer as we go more west. Yeah. It get, yeah. Which is really weird. It well, it goes up and down some. It was like uh, 50, 59 or 50, yeah, 59 today. Yeah. Driving through Montana. Sorry. So that was pretty nice. I'm trying to keep my hand steady. Sorry if I'm making it All right, sick. well, we'll talk to you guys later. We're going to go get dinner here. Uh, a few shakes of a lamb's tail. <laughs> Love oh. you guys. Oh, yeah, look. Here's my friend. That's Buffy the Buffalo. He's my navigator. He he's a good navigator because he don't talk back to me. <laughs> Mark tries to throw him out the window. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get him. He's my buffalo. She I love got him. issues. Pray for her. I love him. He's so cute. Anyways, he's hanging there. Oh, this is a long video. All right. Love Bye. you guys. God bless you. Bye. <laughs> oh, sorry. And that's it.